driver and Paul Walker crash was racer in his own right. Roger Lotus, 1975-2013. You know the headline, Fast and the Furious. Star Paul Walker died Saturday when the driver of the red 2005 Porsche car had a GT that Walker was riding in lost control in a business park drive, wrapped the Porsche around a tree, and then the Porsche burned. But less likely to make headlines was the death of the driver of the car, Walker's friend for nearly a decade, Roger Lotus, who became Walker's formal business partner and financial advisor in 2007. The crash, which occurred about 3:30 p.m., was near the end of a charity event that the tuner on racing company they operated. Rodas was the CEO, always evolving, announced on the company's website. Our next open house in Carmeet is November the 30th from 10am to 4pm. We will have complimentary donuts and coffee. Please call ahead to confirm as we may need to cancel due to weather or track events. Please bring a new toy with you as this meet will be a charity toy drive. Thank you. It's a shame they didn't have to cancel. According to Astorian Wealth Management, the two met when Walker, at a track event, noticed that Rodas was driving a Porsche GT3 that Walker used to own. They ended up racing together at events like the 25 Hours of Thunder Hill, but his schedule limited Walker's racing mostly to time attack type events at Button Willow or other California tracks. Rodas, though, moved up through the ranks from Porsche-only series like the Pirelli Drivers Cup, where he won twice in 2012, into the Pirelli World Challenge, leading a two-car Ford Mustang Boss 302S team, sponsored by Always Evolving and charities that he and Walker supported. Rodas raced car number 52, his co-driver, in car 75, was Eric Davis, owner of Autotopia, a massive, Near legendary car collection in Los Angeles that supplies cars for movie and TV productions. Both rookies in the series, Rodas finished 13 in GTS points, Davis 16th, despite missing the races in ST. Petersburg and Lime Rock. Had Rodas competed in those races, he almost certainly would have been the series rookie of the year. Rodas' highest finish was 5th at Toronto. Impressive since the GTS class has such veteran drivers as season champ Lawson Ash and Book, Jack Baldwin and Peter Cunningham. By sad coincidence, Rodas and Davis raced against another Mustang driver in the class, Roger Miller, who died unexpectedly at age 44 last August. Miller's family owned the Utah Jazz and Miller Motorsports Park near Salt Lake City. Rodas, who turned 38 a month ago, and his road as group company were well known in financial circles in California, largely through an enduring relationship with